Luscious braised pork. You know those dinners that just taste better the next day as leftovers? Well, that's what this is. The gochujang and wine really gets into the meat and oh my god I can't even tell you how good this tastes. If you haven't tasted gochujang, let me introduce you. This is a Korean spice that is just phenomenal. I buy the mild gochujang because honestly I'm afraid that if I bought medium or hot that it would be too much for me. Gochujang is not an upfront in your mouth kind of heat. It's a heat that comes in on the end, and boy is it great. It's a fermented hot pepper paste. National Wine Day is May 25th, and when I thought of what I wanted to do for that day, well, I came up with this. Luscious pork made with gochujang and wine tastes as good, if not better, the day after it's made. The recipe is the simplest to make. You only need a few ingredients, a spoon or a fork. The ingredients are two pounds of cubed pork. I seasoned it with salt, pepper, and garlic powder. Red wine, any wine that you love drinking. Gochujang, of course. Udon noodles. And I buy the frozen edamame. I cook the cubed pork in a large Dutch oven with about a tablespoon or so of olive oil until it's brown. And then I add one, or even better, two really good spoon sized bowls of gochujang. Don't be afraid of it. You'll love it. Trust me. Stir the pork and the gochujang until it's well combined. And now you're going to add wine. And how much, you ask? Well, leave enough in the bottle to enjoy a glass or two. But no, seriously, about half the bottle will do. It's going to cook down anyway. We're going to let this braise on the stove top for about two and a half hours on low heat. Now, if you bought the frozen edamame about six minutes before serving, you're going to add about a cup of the edamame to the pot. The udon noodles only take two minutes to cook, so when you're left with about two to three minutes before serving your meal, add the udon noodles. Serve this with a glass of wine and enjoy. Ah, luscious braised pork for wine day. It is my things to do today. Make it your things to do too. For written instructions, visit my blog on mythingstodo.com. And before you leave, give this video a thumbs up. Tap on the subscribe button also.